Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel All in One. In this video, we are going to study the notes, question and answers of class 5 EVS, chapter 5 that is Natural Resources. If you want the notes of other lessons and other subject, you can check my playlist of my channel. You can easily get from there. First one, solve the following riddle to identify. First question, you cannot live without me. Every plant, trees, animal needs me. Nobody can see me. Who am I? Answer, air. Second question, I occupy major portion of the earth. I satisfy all your thirst. I make animal, tree and plant cool. Who am I? Answer, water. Third question, I let you live on me. I help to grow plant and tree. I support all life on me. Who am I? Answer, earth. Fourth question, I give fruits and nuts. I spread cooling shades. No leaves are there without me. Who am I? Answer, trees. Fifth question, bus, lorry, car, bike, vehicles run by me thousands of years took to make me from underground you extract me. Who am I? Answer fossil fuel. Sixth question. Plate, tumbler, vessels are made up of me. Beautiful jewels are made up of me. My heart will be hardened by you. Who am I? Answer gold. Seventh question, darkness ran away from me. Bright light comes from me, a source of energy. That is me. Who am I? Answer, sun. Second one, classify renewable and non-renewable resources. Water, soil, fossil, fuel, air, wind, minerals, Solar energy, forest. Answer. Renewable resources are solar energy, air, wind, water, soil. Next, non-renewable resources are fossil fuels, minerals. Third question, make a list of the activities done by using solar energy. Answer, first one, photosynthesis. Second one, solar energy is converted into electric energy. Third one, boiling purpose. Fourth one, light. Fourth question, explain the uses of soil and forests. Answer, conservation of soil. First point, field should be covered with vegetation. Second point, the soil should not be used for non-agricultural purposes. Third point, constructions of burns. In the edge of the field. Fourth point. Counter tilling should be adapted in stop areas. Fifth question. Conservation of forest is everyone's is responsibility. Answer. It is process of preserving the forest wealth. This can be done by following methods. First point, 
restrictions on unnecessary felling of trees second point tree planting third point forest disasters such as forest fire and flood should be controlled sixth question name three fuels used to run vehicles answer petrol diesel and kerosene seventh question name three fuels used to cook food at home answer kerosene natural gas coal eighth question give example for the following first one solid fuel answer coal second one liquid fuel answer petrol third one gases fuel answer natural gas ninth question write the uses of the natural resources given below answer first one soil it is necessary for the growth of plants second one forest they provide the necessary food to the animals and many useful materials to man third point solar energy sun is the main resources of heat and light to the earth fourth point animals animals are also renewable resources they enhance their population by reproduction fifth point fossil fuels to run vehicles and cooking purpose sixth point minerals ornaments and constructions purposes next multiple choice questions first question kerosene and diesel are obtained from dash option d natural gas second question which of the following causes least pollution dash option d answer coal next fill in the blanks first question the rocky and earthy layer of earth crust is called dash lithosphere second one natural gas is found with petroleum in oil wells third one the oil extracted from traps is called crude oil fourth one in thermal power station coal is used as fuel to produce electricity fifth one top soil is necessary for the growth of plants sixth one hydrogen is only gaseous fuel that does not contain carbon seventh one hydrocarbons are the compound of hydrogen and carbon atoms eighth one oil extracted from oil traps ninth one the celebration of world environmental day is on 5th june of every year next answer the following questions first one what are natural resources answer nature provides many things such as land air water and soil for the organisms to live 
these things which are provided by nature are called natural resources. Second question, name the type of natural resources. Answer, natural resources are generally classified into renewable and non-renewable resources. Third question, how is soil formed? Answer, the thin top layer of lithosphere containing minerals and organic compounds is called soil. It is formed by the disintegration of rocks. Fourth question, why do we consider coal and petroleum as fossil fuel? Answer, petroleum is a liquid mineral found underneath the soil formed by the action of bacteria, heat and pressure. Coal is formed by the trees which did not desiccate completely got buried under the layers of the rocks in high temperature and pressure. Fifth question, what are the uses of coal? Answer, coal is used a fuel in thermal power plant for the production of electricity. Coal products are used in the making of plastics, drugs, cosmetics, fertilizers, medicines, nylon, etc. Sixth question, what are fossil fuel? Answer, Fossil fuels are formed by the remains of extinct plants and animals which were buried under the earth's crust over millions of years. Example, natural gas, petroleum and coal. Seventh question, what is the meaning of habitat? Answer, the area where an organism normally lives. Eighth question. Define countertilling. Answer. Countertilling means ploughing along the counter lines, outlines of the land drop, water run off, and to prevent soil erosion. Ninth question. Define weathering of rocks. Answer. The land around us keeps changing. This change is caused by water, wind and living beings. Soil is formed by the disintegration of rocks. This process is called weathering of rocks. Tenth question. Distinguish between renewable resources and non-renewable resources. Answer. Resources that are continuously available for use and do not get Existed are called renewable resources. Resources that are limited and get exhausted after continuous use are called non renewable resources. So, this is all about your lesson number 5 natural resources. As I told you, if you want more lessons, Check the playlist of my video. Thank you.